You've been snooping around my workshop again. For the last time, you are not allowed in that room. Even if the door happens to be open, I forbid it. It's your last story. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. How much do you want to bet the paint symbolizes something? Like the paint trail. You know, did we kill our wife? Is our wife dead? Like it when it's dark. Look behind me. Look, there's no one behind me, you guys. Chill the fuck out, okay? Chill the fuck out. I'm about to I'm about to put Reese's puppy cam at the door and put it in my my fucking little top right corner so if anyone tries to open my office door, I'll be able to see it. My love, even though you have not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Now, against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I have never been a deeply religious person. I guess that other people look for in a, I guess what other people look for in a sermon, I found in perfecting my art. But now I can't help but feel like there's a higher power watching over me. They told me. That I would never succeed as a musician. Now I'm playing sold out concerts at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had a difficult character and that I would never find a soulmate. Guess again, finally, a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children of my own, and yet here you are within me. I am quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so much. Oh, so she was pregnant. Oh, I wonder if she was pregnant when she went into the fire. And that's why she's so depressed. These sounds. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I can't breathe. <laughs> The anxiety is coming in, boys. Oh, it is. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew there was this hidden door. What is that sound? like the lights on but it's not on something fucking creepy to me right on that globe one of these
someone kicked it? Did someone like kick the panel? Lewis, why are you being so nice? game is gonna give me a fucking heart attack. <sighs> now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> oh. Do you think he was cheating? I'm not that round. Or is that his wife? Mouse just run into the fucking fire? Sounds like a demon mouse. There's mouse. Are they running into the fire? What the fuck? What the fuck? I am so confused. Hey, in regards to your previous letter, I'm sure it's nothing to be too concerned about. Women tend to get weird after having a baby, hormone imbalance, hormone imbalances, and the like. When we had our first, I remember Valerie got the blues real bad. Postpartum. I would ask her what she wanted for lunch, and she just burst into tears. Just be there for her, and I'm sure it's going to be fine. Now I know I promise not to rush you, and by all means, enjoy your well-deserved time off. But just to let you know, I'm getting phone calls up yin-yang commissions left and right. You're a hot ticket, my friend. Should 
my friend, maybe we should strike the iron while it's hot, but of course the family comes first. Your friend and agent, Tom Caldwell. They did have the baby. Why, is, why does she have like 12 of these fucking hand mirrors and they're all the same? Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Fuck, I guess we're going in the crying bitch's room. Oh, nope, we're not. Just kidding, we are not going in her room. a lot of fucking apples, man. Apples and booze is like their diet. Doesn't seem too healthy. Just saying. What are these? Garlic? Corn? Pot leaves? I mean, like, what? Basil, maybe? We're gonna go with basil. Looks like basil. Oh, water. First step is the hardest. So basically, we're fucking insane, right? We've gone crazy, and this is all in our head, is what I am fucking... What I am coming... The conclusion I am coming to... Back in the kitchen. Same, same, but different. It's a lot of oregano. Or basil. Fuck you, fuck you. What the fuck? Are those like falling out of the picture? What the fuck? Oh. Oh, yeah. Totally. So interested in going through that fucking door now, you know? Like I need to bring the garlic with me. You know, vampires and shit. What are these 
days, I want to just like open this and have like a fucking head in there. At least that would be like satisfying. You know what I mean? Like a head, a finger, a body part. <laughs> First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hand steady. Oh, so am I like miss? I've missed a bunch of stuff. Apparently. Yeah, totally. What are those like demented flamingos? I think they're demented flamingos. Bloody blood flamingos. <laughs> From the depths of hell, blood flamingos. First, I looked for a canvas, not just any canvas I had. All right, that's dope. One, two, three, four, five. So we need to find five more of those to finish the fucking thing. Deep breaths, remember your professional is just the first few strokes and you're over the hump. It's so hard to find it. Shapeless dream. Oh my. This is my own personal mind palace, pretty much. Um, mind palace from hell. That's cool. 